Hey everyone, it's Kirtan Singh here, and I am bringing you my initial reaction to the trailer for Spider-Man Far From Home. It's 5.37 in the morning right now, so I don't have my camera on me because it's in my sister's room, so I'm just using my phone here, so the video is going to look very different for now, and I'm just going to watch the trailer, show you guys my reaction, and we'll see how it goes. Um, I have just woken up, so... Yeah, this is why I'm not really dressed or everything set the way it is for now. And for this trailer itself, I'm not really excited for it because Spider-Man's dead because of Infinity War. So I just find it very weird why they would have the movie come out so soon after Endgame instead of putting it in the later half of the year so that way you can have the trailer come out after Endgame and everything can be promoted after we actually see Spider-Man come back to life. So... I'm a little skeptical, but otherwise, um, let's get started. Thank you, Spider-Man. That was so good. Hey, sorry I'm late. Happy. You look nice. Thank you. You too. Thank you. You dressed? Yes, it is. How'd you know? Okay. <laughs> what just happened? Nice to finally meet you, Spider-Man. <laughs> Here is Jim. Put some clothes on. Let's go for a ride. Is he gonna be okay like that? Might want to turn him over so he doesn't swallow his tongue. Maybe Fury just hijacked her summer vacation. Oh wow, okay, that's actually pretty cool. You got gifts, Parker. But we have a job to do. Are you going to step up or not? You're all alone. Your friends are in trouble. What are you going to do about it? You don't want any part of this. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh, oh, Mysterio is. like Iron Man and Thor rolled into one. But he's no Spider Man. What is it with you and Spider Man? Like, he looks out for the neighbor and has a dope suit, and I really respect him. What's up, dickwad? <laughs> wow, okay, yeah. So, that actually looks pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Mysterio is actually fighting one of those monsters. He's probably just obviously he's an illusionist and everything, so he's just putting a show on and he's gonna end up being a bad guy or whatever. But it's pretty cool. I love seeing Nick Fury again. See, this is the thing. But now I know Nick Fury's alive. John Favreau's alive. Aunt, Aunt May's alive. Um, Peter's obviously gonna be alive. Everyone of Peter one Peter's close friends are gonna be alive and everything. And it's just kind of takes away from Endgame. I'm not gonna lie, but I still like the trailer actually, it's really good. It follows the typical Marvel formula, but yeah, not bad actually, really like it. That, that was my initial reaction to the trailer itself, I think it's a pretty good trailer, but obviously it does take away from Avengers Endgame a little. Let me know your thoughts about the trailer itself in the comment section down below, and I'll catch you all next time.